Hello and welcome back to my channel. So this week's vlog is an organizational vlog. So I am going to be organizing the entire apartment. I am going up to the organized store in Dundrum to pick up all of the organizing bits I need. I have bits from other places as well. So basically in this video, I will just show you how I am organizing my entire apartment that we've just moved into and yeah, I'm super excited, so I'll bring you along for the day. Also, this is what I am wearing. There's my bottle on the floor. I haven't worn my golden goose in so long. I'm really excited to wear them. So we've just arrived at the organized store in Dundrum. My first tip is park on the Tesco level because that is the easiest access to it. <laughs> before I moved to Lisbon and because um, I was kind of looking up for our new place in Lisbon um, but anyway so I kind of forgot about them and then one follower reminded me of them when I was asking people because I put up a photo of our cupboards that we have here and anyway I'm so surprised more people didn't message me about it but basically I reached out to them because I found them online and I like heard through their site and their Instagram feed and was like, oh my God, this is perfect. And basically they offered to do a gifted collaboration. So today was obviously, I was gonna go there anyway, but everything that I picked up was very kindly gifted to me. So any of the things that I include in this video that I got gifted by the organized store, I will obviously tell you that it was gifted. Or you'll know, if it's from the organized store, it was gifted, but not all the things in this video are gonna be from that store. But well, just to preface, I also popped into my in-laws. We stored some stuff there before we went to Lisbon. And I wanted, I'm looking for this red cardigan by this brand, Baba, that I bought a few years ago and I didn't bring to Lisbon because I knew I wouldn't need really warm knitwear. But I can't find it anywhere and I really wanted it for the festive season and yeah, it was such a beautiful cardigan. Anyway, I did find my fruit bow that I had from, I think this is from Maid. Um, and I also found plates that I got for my 30th from my girlfriends um, from Industry, I think. I think, God, they still have the... Um, price on them and the tags so I'm so excited to be able to use these um, in our new home so there's four of these they're so pretty so yeah I am probably going to do all the building during the week of the furniture but okay 
Okay, so this is the bin we went with. It is the Brabantia. It is two inner buckets of 230 litres. So it comes with a five year guarantee, which is super handy, especially she was saying if you have a kid and they love bashing the lid open. If it breaks at any stage, you just get a brand new one. So that's why I want this one. And I'm so excited to not be living out of these bags for our bins. Okay, the day is finally here where I get to actually spend the day organizing with you guys. So I brought you up to the organized store and showed you kind of vaguely the things I got, but I will show you in more detail today. We managed to build the shelves. I got my dad actually to come over because I was too lazy. It was actually so easy. All you need is a hammer, um, but we didn't have a hammer. So I was like, dad, will you come over with your hammer and do it for me? So that was great. Um, I'm gonna show you all of the places that basically need organizing. So the cupboard space is okay, but when you live with a man, I feel like staying organized has to be even more intense. Like you have to put way more effort into it because they, if there isn't like, I feel like the only way for a man to be organized is for him to be hanging everything. So I want to give Connor as much of the hanging space as possible because folding things and putting them in cupboards correctly is just not either his forte or a man's forte so basically i'm going to reorganize the cupboards today i'm going to fill the um new drawer space that we have i'm going to clear out that storage cupboard that i've showed you it's literally full of ironing and laundry and shoes and tripods and all of this stuff so I'm gonna be organizing that. I have piles of stuff everywhere. My bathroom needs a full organization. Um, the counter space needs clearing. I have some really nice shelving for in there. And yeah, just places that I didn't have before for the likes of towels and sheets and bed covers. Um, I'm just so excited to have things for all that. I also got laundry baskets up in the organized store. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna just get right into it and clear out some of the cupboards and get organizing. So let's go. I will also link everything that I bought for helping with organizing um, today. There are a few more bits that I would like to get, um, but yeah, I'll link everything below. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please please do if you haven't shared my channel with a friend or a family member i absolutely love my youtube family this is like my happy safe space i love getting creative here and i love just sharing everyday life here um it's the real stuff and that's what it's all about getting honest and gritty and painful and ugly and glam with you guys whatever it is that i'm doing over here so i love sharing my journey with you guys so i would love if you did subscribe um but yeah let's get into today's video okay so this is basically all laundry and i got another bag i got two laundry bags so currently we are using abe's laundry bag in here this is all dirty clothes which i'm going to sort today um but Abe's laundry bag is covered under the mountain of stuff in here. So um, this is Abe's laundry bag. So this will be going back in his room, which is great because Connor likes to throw his dirty clothes when he's getting them ready in there on the floor um, instead of bringing it in here. So, um, God, there's so much dirty clothes. So, so I'm gonna do loads of laundry today. This is the other laundry bag I got. The fact that it's small makes me try to keep up with my laundry. And actually, I'm just gonna clear out this first and sort the laundry. These are all IKEA organizers, which might actually fit in the drawers, which would be great, the new drawer space. Um, this is a sack with my sunglasses. Okay, that's all clear. So I'm gonna get the drawers in and then let's get packing them. 
So I love that with these you were able to choose what depth of drawers you wanted. So there's the really thin ones on top, which I thought would be good for just like toiletries, extra beauty products. And then down here are the really deep ones and then the medium size. So I'm gonna use these for clothes and then I'm gonna use the really deep ones for sheets and towels and all that kind of stuff. easy to clean down and look really just minimal and with all the products where they stack nicely and are super aesthetic I just like this is my favorite part I feel like I'm gonna need more storage for the bathroom but I bought this three-tier cabinet organizer and um, it has spices on the image I bought this in home store more in the Frascati Center and um, they actually had these in the organizer store as well but I had bought this previously um, I'm gonna test this out and then if it's really, if it fits perfectly and if it works, then I might get another one so that I can have two here, but depending I might need something different. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited about this tiered shelving situation. And then I want to organize all of my like most used products obviously in this and down in the cupboard underneath the sink. I feel I want like tampons and um, sanitary pads, that kind of stuff down underneath the sink. Um, things that may be not so aesthetic but I use often, I'll put there. And then the things that I use that are super aesthetic, I will put um, here. And then I can rotate when I'm going through phases of different products. Um, yeah, so let's get into it. By the way, the Pixie Eye Masks and the Superberry Dream Cleansing Balm by Use of the People are two of my most used products. The LME's Cleanser as well, which is in my shower. Um, that will stay there, but I'll show you as well. My most used products are underneath the sink at the moment and they will now be transferred up onto my little shelving unit. <laughs> figure out which ones I'm going to be keeping out and which I'm going to put away. So my Drunk Elephant Body Cleanser for the shower, I bloody love this. I try to ration it because it's pretty pricey but actually I love it. My Drunk Elephant Shampoo, my Body Lotion, I love this Body Lotion. Ooh, I forgot about this. My Hydration Serum. At the moment I'm using the Aben one so I might continue to use that. But let's keep this out. Micellar water. Um, I'm actually not mad on the Drunk Elephant one. I prefer the Aven. Um, there are travel size things. Oh, I love this. Let's keep this out. I got these on Amazon, these little organizers. So I might, I might actually use these in the shelving unit out there. Ooh, my road. I'll keep this out. My Laneige lip balm. Oh, this is great. Oh, my Pixi Glow Tonic. Love that. Love the Kiehl's uh, Midnight Recovery Concentrate. Definitely keeping that out.
unit here. So with these units, you can choose to get these kind of shelf-like things on top. They actually just slide on top, which is kind of handy because you don't have to drill them on and choose to have them there permanently. So these go on top, which is great because then you can use this as a shelf space as well. I'm not very happy about this, but I'm going to be using this for now as my shoe storage because I don't feel like it's very tidy but or clean. I, like This is just going to get really dirty from the shoes. Um, so I might put something underneath. But for now, this is where my shoes will go. And that is that entire unit organized, basically. I am so bloody delighted. So I changed this bed around a little bit because Again, Connor was complaining about not having enough space. So, and I did want to organize it better here. So basically I've put his shoes, his shoes have now gone up there. His hanging space is still pretty loose. We should, we could get more hangers, I think. Um, Ikea hangers, the best. I've, I bought these, I brought these, sorry. I bought them in Lisbon when we moved there first and since then have only bought these hangers because they are my favorite. A little bit slippy, but really good. And then I've used these um, Ikea separators. They're the Scub, S-K-U-B. Um, but these will have his t-shirts. My socks are in the back there. And then I'm gonna put more of his t-shirts here. although it's not that late this winter is killing me i am so delighted with all of the organizing that i've done um there's definitely a few more bits that i need um i think for the guest bathroom bathroom maybe a few more organizing little bits and a little bit of a display for their hand wash or whatever and i definitely want to get one of the shower shelves that kind of sucks into the wall so that I can store like my face wash and my shampoo and conditioner and then the main thing I think is our shoes our shoes are just we have quite a lot of shoes and we have nowhere really good enough a good we don't have really a good space to put them and um, so I'm gonna have to come up with a solution for that I definitely remember in the organized store they had one to hang on the back of the door where loads kind of stacked um vertically uh so that might be a really good solution but yeah until then i hope you enjoyed today's video and if you haven't subscribed please do i will be bringing definitely another one of these because i'm not done yet are you ever done organizing i don't think so